What's going on everybody? Adam here with eTrailer. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the WeatherTech Cargo Protector. So as you can see here, if you guys don't really use the back seats of your Tahoe a lot, this is going to be a great way to protect all that. As you guys can see, on the back of here, we are going to have some carpet. So when we do fold down the seats, we're gonna have carpet right there too and this stuff is extremely hard to clean this is pretty much a brand new car and it's already kind of dirty we haven't really had a whole lot of people in here yet or cargo and it's still kind of dirty this is going to protect all that carpet so no spills or leaks or anything if you guys are carrying around a lot of food you got a big old pot of chili you do not want it to fall over and get into your carpet because trust me, it's happened to me and it is not fun to clean up. So this is definitely going to be able to hold all that water, chili, or if you guys are gardening and you guys put all your tools back here, it's going to keep all that grease off of it too. This material is going to resist against all those corroding liquids that you guys may be putting back here. If you guys are a mechanic, you guys throw some brakes and stuff. Brake fluid is extremely corrosive and it's gonna do quite a bit of damage to this carpet. This is going to be a great custom fit mat that's just gonna go in the back and protect your car from whatever may happen. As you can see here, we do have the black liner in now. We just picked the black just because it looked the best with the black interior, but we have other colors. So if you guys got tan interior, we got tan, we have gray and we have cocoa too. So. Whatever kind of interior you guys have on your Tahoe, just go ahead and pick whatever color is gonna look best. It does come in a box and it's rolled up. So as you guys can see here, it's not necessarily fitting and laying down on the ground too well, but we have only had this out for a little bit less than 24 hours and we're just kind of letting it sit. If you guys are in hotter climates, it's definitely going to help it kind of soften up and lay down. But once it's laid down like that, it's going to be able to retain its shape. So it's not going to deform or anything like that. And the nice thing about that is we do have the lips all the way around. So like I said before, any kind of material or fluids that you guys spill, whether it's like mulch, dirt, or even just liquid like chili or water it's all going to stay in the contents of the whole entire protector which is nice and then you can go ahead and just kind of pull it out drain it and maybe even hose it off if it's something sticky the nice thing about it is it doesn't have any like pegs or anything underneath to kind of keep it into place but it does have a textured finish and it isn't a very slick plastic type it's a unique material that's going to kind of grip it a decent amount, and especially if you guys have stuff in it, it's not really going to shift around because it really is a pretty tight fit once it gets all laid out and everything like that. One thing I would add is definitely a second row WeatherTech liner just because floor mats in the second row is something I would definitely get because kiddos are usually back there. Doggos, this would be good for dogs too. I usually bring my dogs to the park or something like that i throw them in the back and pet hair not really too easy to clean so it's gonna be great for that and might as well if you guys are getting this one and the second row might as well go ahead and get driver and passenger side floor mats we have them all here at etrailer.com but that's pretty much all there really is to see and look at when it comes to the weathertech cargo area protector on our 2020 chevrolet tahoe